Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm finally gonna unbox these two. So I did end up, end up going with the Apple Baby Mesa and Vista V2 for our stroller and car seat. I actually bought these at Bye Bye Baby last week and I still haven't opened them so I'm pretty excited to do that today. I did want to go ahead and film it because even when I was buying it, I had questions about what actually came in the box. And if you want to go ahead and see what's inside the boxes and how everything looks, then just go ahead and keep on watching. Yeah, let's go ahead and start with the car seat. So this is how it looks once you open the car seat up. And then I did get this in the color Jordan. All right, so this is how it looks without that plastic on. And then the manual and everything is right here. This color is actually really cute. I really love it. It comes with the base attached already. So I went ahead and took off the car seat off of the base. So to show you all how the base looks. So there is a bunch of indicators right here. You can see it's red. Whenever it's latched on, it turns green. There is more indicators right here. around this side too and a couple things on the car seat so this is how far the canopy goes as you can see it's not too much so that's kind of a bad thing if you care about that um this right here is for Installing the car seat without the base if you're ever in that situation You just use a seat belt and put it over this This is the latch release for these straps right here You can also just pull on this and it'll tighten it And then warning labels are down here There's Also some more over here So this button right here is the one that um hooks onto the stroller, so you click this, take it off the stroller. These buttons for this right here, put it back and forth. Hey guys, I'm gonna go ahead and open the stroller now, which is my favorite part, or the part I'm most excited for. Box looks, once you open it. The paperwork for the stroller right here. This is how it's actually packaged inside the box. The actual base comes already built, kind of. And then there's three boxes and a bag. This one has the toddler seat and bassinet inside. This one looks like it has the two back wheels. So this one has the bar that goes up front when you use a toddler seat. And this last box comes with the two front wheels and the rain cover. So the stroller is actually in the color Jake, which is the all black one. This is the toddler seat right here and then the bassinet. The stroller build took less than, what, five minutes. This button right here is to pull out the handle. Here is what you push to actually 
fold the stroller in. And this is how this looks. There's a pocket right here. A drink pocket right here. A little mesh pocket. You could slide stuff in. And there's a lot of space. The wheels to put them on like you saw. You click this button. Click the button to take them off if you want to. There's front brakes right here. You click that. Once it's not green, that's when the brake is on. And we move the back brake. Oh, I'm not going anywhere. So the handlebars are leather. All right, a few things about the toddler seat. These buttons right here on each side are to move this right here. These buttons are to take off the actual toddler seat and change it. You got your belt. The leather bar, I didn't know this, but it actually has a zipper back here. And you can actually replace this leather bar. It's just the regular canopy. There's a mesh spot you can open up. And then you pull this zipper right here. And it opens all the way up. And there's another mesh cover right here. So it does go pretty far down. So no sun is gonna be in baby's eyes. And then there's gonna be a button right back here. And that button is to bring the seat all the way down or to however you want it. Just need to lock it. But this is the most upright it goes to. And then you can lay it all the way flat for your newborn, which they do offer a newborn insert that you put on here. But I will not be purchasing that just because you can also use the bassinet or... Me, I'm just gonna use my car seat. Let me go ahead and put on the bassinet now. All right, so for the bassinet, there's not really much to it. These buttons are to put the canopy down. This button's to take the actual bassinet off of the seat. As you can tell, there is indicators. There's another canopy you can pull out and it goes further and then you just push it back in real quickly with the bassinet this is the bassinet holder that come well it doesn't come with it you have to buy it separately but this is going to be where she's going to be sleeping at for the first two months and it'll be just right next to my bed and then also there is a little cover for the bassinet that you just zip on and this is how the stroller looks with the car seat on. So this car seat, you do not need an adapter to put it on the stroller. It just slides right in the same way as the bassinet and toddler seat. If you have any questions, just comment down below. I'll go ahead and try to answer it for you. So it's not going to be really much of a review. I just want to unbox it and show you a little feature that I'm learning myself. Um, I will say something about the car seat though. When I was looking at reviews, uh, there's one that's all black. So people were saying that that one made the baby too hot. So that's why I went with this color. If you're wanting to buy the stroller, do your research and make sure that it's going to be a good investment for you. For me, uh, I did think about it a lot because it is pretty pricey. Um, just the fact that this stroller is able to turn into a double stroller is really what sold me because I do plan on having another baby. Not anytime soon, but I do plan on that. So that's one big reason why we went with this stroller. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for the video. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll go ahead and see you on the next video. Peace.